think there's something that we can all recognize different from entertainment, uh, mindless amusement, yeah. escapism, vegging out, yep. and how in the end exhausted we feel yep. and not recreated and, and renewed. Yeah. And then leisure, which sometimes takes us by surprise because we're walking through yeah. a park or we're sitting down to have coffee with a friend yep. or we're reading a book that cultivates our imagination. Yeah, so I, I can answer the question really, really easily. And, and it's, it, it's back to language. Um, we don't use hyphens enough in the English language. Hmm. We don't. Uh, we use hyphens to fragment words that we want to fit onto a page. We don't use it to actually articulate or emphasize the roots of words. So uh, recreation, recreation is really recreation. Just like remembrance is not cognitive, it's re-membrance. It's actually remembering yourself, oh, recommitting wow. to a community or an idea. Whoa. Well, so, so leisure is most like recreation, um, if we want to look at what it's like. It's, it's, it's not like vacation. It's not getting away from. It's not escaping. Uh, it's not even retreating. Um, real leisure is more like recreation. It's about, um, so uh, maybe I'll just start with a statement from Joseph Pieper. He says that um, we work for the sake of leisure. Uh, we don't leisure for the sake of work. Yeah. We don't vacate so that we can go and be refreshed so we can enter back into work. No, we actually work so we get the things done that are essential so that we have freedom just to be who we are. I heard you say that three years ago. It changed my life. Yeah, I'm not it, even kidding. It blows your mind. So, and so he, and he asked the question, he says, let's consider this for a moment. You know, so in his book, Leisure is the Basis of Culture, which I love Joseph Pieper's a philosopher because he just titles the book with what he wants to say. Right? I'm wondering so, if it's here. So Leisure, the Basis of right Culture, seven uh, cardinal virtues, or the four cardinal virtues, beautiful books from Joseph Pieper, uh, great German uh, philosopher of top notch. But you know, he walks through this and says, look, so if, if we work... If we are, let, me, let me go backwards. If we leisure for the sake of work, that means that leisure is, is secondary to work, that leisure then is subservient to work. And so in other words, leisure is just for the purpose of work. But he says, look, we're, we're humans made just for work. Now work's a central aspect of what we do, uh, but we weren't made just for work, right? We were actually made for leisure. A real being is not from what we do, but from the product of what we do that allow us to be. 